Alright oh guys, welcome back to more PS5 Master League. Today, we are against Bolton at home. And uh, I think we only beat this team, what was it, 1-0 last time? I think in the reverse fixture, I'm almost like certain about that. So, yeah. And uh, is it me or does, does Rossi there look like a bit like Mewtwo? He does, he does a bit. He does a bit. He's the next up and coming Mewtwo, maybe. But yeah, Mewtwo is uh, not here today. He is not here because uh, he's on international duty. So I'm hoping that doesn't affect him too much because, um, you know, when we do have players that go out on international duty, the, uh, sometimes they can stay out for quite a few weeks, maybe four or five weeks, depending on the fatigue. So hopefully he doesn't get a lot of fatigue or anything and he isn't... Um, he, he doesn't get too exhausted, um, is what we're hoping for today. So, uh, yeah, and uh, that's going to make it through to Ronaldo. He's going to put it over to Eto, who's going to get a goal for Eto. Not bad. That's a really good start. Eto and Ronaldo up front today. Rossi is in the attacking midfield today because he was on pretty good form. And uh, like I say, we want to rest up for the Chelsea game, make sure we just get through that kind of thing. So, uh, yeah, Eto was on uh, red form today, and he's got a goal for himself there, which uh, is not bad. Um, pretty much just about a tap-in, but still, but still. Another assist for Ronaldo there. He's doing pretty well on the assist board. Leaderboard, that is, for the uh, league, but he's also pretty much up there. I think he's, like, probably second play. I haven't checked the goal score. He's probably, like, second on the um, goal scorers. Um, but, yeah, uh, we got... Um, Fabregas uh, alongside Joe Cole in the centre of the midfield. The Joe Cole is more of an attacking midfielder. So, uh, yeah, we've also got uh, Kaiser in there in the DMF area. And we've also got, at the back, uh, we've got Colaccini, who's the uh, captain today. And that's a really good ball over, uh, but it couldn't find Eto. Um, yeah, we've got uh, Colaccini in there. At left back, we have Ashley Cole. Uh, at right back, we have Cafu in for uh, Ramos and we've also got John in the centre back and Casillas is in goal because I think uh, I think he's on yellow form or is it red it's one of those but yeah <laughs> so yeah that's uh, pretty much today's team and here's Joe Cole and that doesn't quite make it to Ronaldo never mind that doesn't matter we've got Ruff in goal here and Gotti Hunt here and uh, yeah so pretty much a big change team there everybody's pretty much um rested though pretty much after that last chelsea game so just want to keep things like that as much as possible and uh yeah ronaldo's looking at this one oh straight into the wall never mind and uh here's fabregas and it's been kept out. Is that offside by Eto, really? Okay. <laughs> I don't know. That came off the other player. How is that offside? What? And Rossi must have got a touch on that then. That's all I can think there. And uh, here's Eto again. He's offside yet again, like uh, a moment later. So I like it when we get to change the team up like this and get to see some of our other players. So, uh, yeah. This is, uh, I think, fixture 21, isn't it? So, getting on towards the end of the league now. Season, Bolton are still not even on double points. They're still on nine. Would you believe it? But, uh, yeah, some big games going on today. I think it's Villa against uh, uh, Pez United was one of them. And Rangers and Fulham down at the bottom. So, we'll see how that gets on today and see what's happening. But, yeah, pretty interesting to see if Villa can... Um, because they've been in, they've been in like 15th slash 16th full season kind of thing. But it'd be interesting. Yeah, they could beat Real Madrid, you know. <laughs> but um, it'd be interesting to see if they can actually pull it off maybe. And it could be Fulham to go down, which would uh, kind of surprise me. Or possibly Rangers. But uh, still a few games to go yet. Casillas gets to that easily. And it's out to uh, Kaiser here. Here's Cafu. Here's Joe Cole, who tries to put uh, Ronaldo in, but it's cut out. And 
And here is Ronaldo. He's brought off the ball there. I think because he's on the free kicks today, so he's probably going to take this one, but it's not uh, going to be a shot, surely not, from there. That, that would be asking a lot to score from there, I reckon. Uh, here's Kaiser. He's wondering what to do. He's going to go out to Fabregas wide. Who whips it in. Ooh. Give us a bit of trouble, Bolton, last time. Played him on the final day of last season. We won, I think it was 2-0. They, uh, they survived on that last day. They had, we, we sent uh, Fabregas on loan to them last season. Which is probably why they stayed up. <laughs> probably. They were relegated, I think, was it season three, I want to say? And then they've come back up, and then um, they've stayed up. But not like they're going to be going back down again at this rate. Nine points after 20 games is, uh, is nowhere near good enough. Need a miracle in the last part of the season. Here's Fadiga, cut out by John nicely. And I think Eto is way offside there. What is he doing? To see him on the radar. Was going to play Messi today because he was on red form, but then I remembered, oh, well, you know, it, everything counts and we need um, an Eto. He's, he's on red form, so we may as well play him. Here's Fadiga, and he's going to put it into the box. Oh, it's cleared. And that's a nice ball out there to uh, Rossi, and he can't keep it going, but oh well. Rossi, we just picked him up at the end of the uh, transfer window in the summer. Just because sometimes we do that. Sometimes. <laughs> and here, here's Fabregas. And it's Rossi, and he's uh, he's actually got a goal. He got a goal against, I think it was Arsenal in the Cup. So, I mean, that's something... I think he's like 23 or something, so... Hmm. Struggling to get our passing right today a bit. And uh, Cafu takes care of that. Booted up by Casillas, and that's half-time. Yeah, we could be a little better there. Um, it's a shame we haven't got... Maybe another one, but just keep going at it. And we're off. So uh, one uh, last 45 minutes to go and Rossi commits a foul very early on. But uh, yeah, like uh, that last... Uh, Champions League uh, results you know, be, oh that didn't go through be interesting to see if like uh, Arsenal could beat AC Milan and get through and that would be it'd be really uh, a really good one if they can I think it could be United to go to the final again though possibly it looks like I mean if they they thrashed Ajax and they've got a really good team up front you know for scoring goals even though they've lost Ronaldo now it's, um, I wouldn't say it's anything too much to worry about, kind of, but, yeah. And, oh, that didn't make it through. And uh, Cafu is out of position. And here's Nolan. And the ball through there is going to miss. And that was a really, really nice lofted through ball. Look at that. I mean, Casillas was rooted. If it was on target, Fadiga's going to come off from a can there. I wouldn't have brought Fadiga off, I don't think, but yeah. We got away with that. And I think that's offside from Eto, is it? No, he's going to still be on. And, oh, Ronaldo couldn't uh, get enough time. And here's Eto. Hun Ingotti. 
O'Brien to McCann, who's just come on. So they're playing a 4-3-3 because they've got uh, a left winger on there. And uh, here's McCann. We need to stop him. And uh, Cafu gets in there. Into the box there. Headed away. And uh, here's Joe Cole. Pretty nicely done. Over to Ronaldo. And it's still Ronaldo. And it's Rossi. And it's Eto with a shot. It was on target. The angle was a little tight. Goalkeeper was down to it. Cafu is uh, back there. Whipped back in again. And it's not quite clear. Kaiser's in there. I think Eto was in there. Are we going to get a second goal today or not? I think we're kind of pushing it a bit. And uh, nice, oh, nearly nicely stopped. Here's Nolan. And uh, we're all right. We are all right. And that's going to go out. It's not very exciting here, I'll admit. They're going to bring Pedersen on now. Well, I'm starting to get a little bit nervous about Cafu, so I'm going to bring him off and put Sergio Ramos on just for these last few minutes. Torres is coming on for Eto and Haleb is on for uh, Rossi just for these last uh, few minutes here. So, uh, yeah. And here is Torres, who puts Kaiser in. Oh, so close, Kaiser. Unbelievable. Would be good to see him get a goal, wouldn't it? Um, we, 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 I just don't think we're going to get a second goal in this, to be honest. I'm just not sure I see it happening. I think that's offside. Is that not offside, really? Kaiser is back for it. Here's Ramos. Says uh, Colaccini. Oh, can't... Yeah, just trying all these little moves, but they're not working. <laughs> Here's John, of all players, who's uh, lost the ball now. Stopped by Ramos. Is Fabregas. Over to uh, Torres here now. And it's Haleb. We haven't seen Haleb in a while, actually. And tries to put Ronaldo in. <laughs> it's just, it's just not. It's just it's kind of the same as the last Bolton game we had, where it's just, yeah, we've got a goal, but you know, there ain't much more than that. And that's dodgy ball back. And stoppage time. We're in now. They're gonna bring Vaste on for the uh, last uh, minute or so here. And Fabregas' touch lets him down, and that's full time. Well, it wasn't very exciting, that, honestly, guys. But a win is a win, and uh, the job is done, nonetheless. So, uh, yeah, Kaiser was our man of the match today. I think maybe I agree, because he was pretty good there, winning the ball back in his DMF area. So... Yeah, nobody really stood out. Even Ronaldo didn't really... I mean, he was alright, but didn't really stand out too much. And I think that's the first game now where he hasn't scored. So, uh, yeah. Uh, Rossi, 7. I thought it was pretty good, actually. Fabregas was alright. I thought Joe Cole was alright. I think Ashley Cole was doing a solid job. Cafu was getting a little bit worried about him because he was letting like some players past him here and there. So I just thought I'd bring him off. Eto got a goal, but only 6.5. Yeah, it, it, it's a done job. Anyway, guys, uh, fixture 21 results. The first thing that stands out to me there is 
Arsenal losing at home to We United 4-0. Wow. Interesting, that one. Fulham pick up a very vital win there over um, Rangers, 3-2. But also there, Aston Villa pick up a 2-1 win of Pez United. So that's really going to change things up at the bottom. I think that might even... I think that brings Rangers down into a relegation position now. Everton and uh, Manchester United drew 2-2, so that's good for us. Chelsea also drew there to Middlesbrough, 1-1. Spares won against Newcastle, 2-1. And Wigan and West Brom was 2-2. So this is the uh, league table. There's one change there, and that's Spares moving up to fourth. And uh, Chelsea down to fifth there. Uh, we United are on 36 points now. Everton are on 32. Yeah, they're still keeping up there. Wigan had a really good chance to go ahead of Everton today. But uh, West Brom, I mean, they're still doing good. They are 10th uh, there. Arsenal still 9th. And uh, as you can see, Rangers have moved down into 15th later on in the season. They were looking fine all season. They were looking fine. And now all of a sudden, they're uh, down into 15th. It's really... You, you just don't know who's going to end up 15th now. I think it's safe to say Bolton will, will end up last, but... It, it's it's close, it's close. Pez United are doing all right there. Middlesbrough are doing all right. I think they drew a Chelsea today, didn't they? So, you know, I'd, I, I would say it's just between 12th and 15th there. So, uh, yeah, well done to Villa and Fulham, I guess. Anyway, back with Europe in the uh, next round of fixtures in the Champions League. It's the second leg of the quarterfinals. We've got Arsenal taking on AC Milan there. Arsenal got a 2-1 lead. So, uh, yeah, even if, Ars uh, even if AC Milan won 1-0, it wouldn't matter because Arsenal got the uh, two away goals. So we'll see about that. Barcelona desperately need some goals, though, against Valencia to tonight, though, in this one. Um, pushing it a bit, but, uh, yeah, I think Ajax kind of need a miracle, honestly, because uh, even if they get, get three goals... That won't be enough because uh, Manchester United would have the four way goals to their three and a home goal for Ajax. So, yeah, that is coming up next time, guys. Join us for that one. Please do call it, subscribe, and share as always. We've got a 3 0 lead over Chelsea in the first leg. Just got to finish the job next time. Take care. See you then.